Hello and welcome to Dateline Lagos, where we inform you of some of the activities of the state government. I'm Loretta Chiogo. Today on the program, Lagos State Governor Akil Miambodi declares intention to run for a second term. Lagos State Government organizes four-day empowerment training for union leaders across the state. And the state government begins cleanup of Lagos waterfront across the state. Let's begin with the Lagos State Governor, Mr. Akumi Ambodi's announcement of his intention to seek a re-election in 2019 on the platform of the All Progressives Congress, APC. Mr. Ambodi made this known while addressing scores of residents and party faithful who defied the heavy downpour to witness the declaration ceremony in Alausa, Ikeja, the state capital. While the governor promises to fulfill his campaign promises, and do more if re-elected for another four-year term. It's a wet day, but this party faithful of the All Progressives Congress in Lagos State defy the rains to gather here at Alausai Keja, the state capital. <laughs> The reason for being here is to show solidarity for the state governor, Mr. Akinwumi Ambodi, who is declaring his intention to run for governorship the second time. Now. The governor goes down memory lane on how the journey started three years ago, saying how much the support he got from loyalists have helped him so far. Fellow Lagosians, Exactly four years ago, I called on you to join me in a journey of selfless service to build a secure and prosperous Lagos state driven by a vibrant economy and supported by quality service, equity and justice. You believed in me and gave me your support. In the last three and a half years, I have fulfilled my promises to you to make Lagos work for all. With your support, we have made Lagos a better place and changed the face of our state. I did not do it alone. We did it together because you believed. <laughs> Our state has remained steadily prosperous because of your positive outlook. I urge you to always stay positive in your personal and communal lives and continue to aspire to great things. I thank you all for believing in me and in our government, and for your support thus far. I thank all members of our great party, the All Progressive Congress, our political leaders, most especially our national leader, Ashwa Jubala Ahmed Sinumbu, for giving me the platform to contribute to the further growth and development of our state. Mr. Ambode asked for more of such support as he prepares for another leg of the race to keep him on the helms of affairs of the state for four more years. In these three and a half years, as your governor, I have seen visible proof that we can achieve un unbelievable things when we all come together. We know more than I believe in our dreams. We achieved because you believed. But there is still a lot more to be done. But I am not daunted. I am not tired. And I am sure you feel the same way. Because we all envision a better Lagos. A Lagos of our dreams. So, by this humble process, of which I have obtained the nomination form, 
I humbly call you again to give me your support as I seek to continue with your mandate to steer the affairs of our state. I ask you to believe again and together let's achieve more. God bless you all. Other party representatives at the national and local levels assure the governor of their unflinching support as the race begins with party primaries later in October. If the promises of support made here are kept, the governor may be rest assured of a good fight at the poll come March 2019.